Good afternoon and welcome to Russell's Holly Blog. This is the view from my window. It's 2.30 in the afternoon on a Thursday. I think it's April the 10th. Robin did a good job of confusing me about the date today. So. If I'm off by a day, blame her. Um, I did a lot of running around uh, yesterday, I guess, and so today I'm kind of paying the price for it. God, I've gotten so fat that I can kind of like rest my belly on the windowsill. <laughs> God. Um, I think I'm really considering lipo because my gut isn't that big yet and those are usually considered the best candidates for lipo. And the benefits of lipo aren't just that it gets, makes you thin again, but it removes those fat cells forever. Because when you diet, those fat cells just shrivel up and wait to be wicked and then they're like dormant. And when you feed them the fat, and the grease that wakes them up, you're in trouble again. But if you suck them out of your body, they can't come back anymore. So, I'm becoming more and more pro plastic surgery. I'm totally in favor of people getting um, that operation for obesity where they like remove parts, portions of their stomach put that band around their stomach to make it smaller um, I mean I know some people who were uh, are just you know they need help with the surgery and uh, I can understand why you'd be afraid to do it but, you know, a lot of those obese people, they're so stigmatized, you know? It's like the last uh, acceptable stigma. And, uh, it's wrong. Because, uh, I know a few obese people. And uh, one in particular, she is an angel. She's just the sweetest person in the world. Why does the phone always ring when I do this? Anyway, I'll get back to that later. It's probably just a call, a call, a bill collector. Uh, so, yeah. Hit the lap band surgery or whatever it's called. Whatever it is. Do whatever it takes. Um... I don't know. I've got to figure out a way to get back to my old weight because I can't exercise with my knee all torn up the way it is. And I don't, I don't even want to do breathing exercises with Robin in the morning. That's how bad it's gotten. But, let me see, I forgot to put the LCD viewer on, I always forget to do that, and I put the thing right up to my eye, like a big silly person. I think I'm going to sign out soon, anyway, it's getting kind of, this, uh, this entry is getting kind of long, but you know on my blog, my other blog, Russell is watching. I've been counting all the, uh, trying to locate as many of those cameras that the, uh, police have focused on us. Because I don't know if you've heard lately, but the LAPD is a serial killer. <laughs> they killed 18 people so far this year. So, let me go get the phone. And, uh, 
the rest of you have a great day. You know, Robin pointed out this bush, how this, despite all the, all the, you know, digging and everything, life will, will prosper in, in the tiniest little environment you give it. This doesn't look, this stuff doesn't look like it's very full of life, though, it does it? It's more like a mausoleum. Okay, over and out.